Helldivers, a new major order has just been announced by Super Earth. This one's very interesting because it's just released a new mission type. So we're tasked with going to the Umlaut Sector. These four planets have terminal control systems on them that we need to reactivate while defending them against terminates, which is a very, very cool mission type, like a pseudo defense mission. And it's timed perfectly along with the new update, which reduces the number of Bile Titans and Chargers and increases the number of small enemies, which we can try it out by jumping into this mission type. So to get started, obviously you get to your navigation and you get a message from Super Earth. Now I love these messages because it's just feeding you lore constantly and it obviously feels like we're moving towards a common goal which is awesome. So the message reads, upon each barrier planet now stands a network of massive termocyte dispensing towers, the terminate control system. Once activated, the TCS, or the terminal control system, will exterminate every terminate on that planet and inoculate it against all future infestations. So that's interesting. However, surges of terminate activity have forced the SEAF engineers to evacuate. Now only the hell divers can ensure the safety of our citizens. The terminal control system must be activated at any cost. So does this mean that once we activate them, that these planets will permanently not have terminates on them? I don't know, but these are the four planets that we're going to be looking at. And we're going to dive into them with this new mission type, as you can see here. Operation status, we're going to jump in. We've got activate terminal control systems. That's the mission we're going to try out today. And what I would recommend for this mission is towers. Anything defense related. I made the mistake of bringing my run and gun build or my run and gun loadout. And it, yeah, it slows it down a bit. Turrets are very useful here. You need to be careful because the turrets can, as far as I know, damage the systems themselves, which can cause cause issues. Um, but I would recommend bringing turrets to, to keep the, the hordes away from the generators. So they have introduced some new voice lines and, and things related to this particular mission, which is really cool. So I think they've probably got a lot of these kind of things in their back pocket, much like the mech, and they're just going to throw them at us over time. Obviously with the mech, the timeline for that was increased rapidly by how quick that we took over the planet that we needed for, for the mechs themselves. But just landing on here, it's a completely new map, and as you can see, we've got the TCS right in front of us. Very cool. It's, it's pretty focused, this map is pretty focused around, around that particular thing. So make your way over to the button at the base of the tower to start the mission. And what you're supposed to do from here is to power up three battery silos. Um, depending on the difficulty, obviously easier said than done in some cases. As you can see here, my ally had activated battery silo one, but we'll see what happens with that one later on and I'm going to head over to battery silo 2. So while you're doing this, enemies will be attacking you. Um, the numbers are quite low, obviously, at the start, but as you go along, um, it can get a bit hectic. But you see here, activate battery silo 2, and we just need to find one of these control panels for each of the battery silos, activate them. Um, as a side note, you can see battery silo 1 is now critically unstable all of a sudden. Um, they got heavily attacked early on, and if it gets damaged enough, it deactivates and causes tremors, which is really interesting. Um, you'll see more of these tremors later on. So we work towards getting battery solo one, two, and three all up. And once they're all up, you proceed to the extraction site and initiate termocyte dispersal, which is pretty simple. Um, I didn't want to go in through show, show the whole mission. You guys are going to do this yourself. And um, we proceed to extraction just like you normally would. We activate the the system, I didn't get a chance to get there in this particular mission, but it activates tremors everywhere and the extraction uh, pod drops as a result of that as well. So it's a standard extraction at that point. There's nothing funky that happens here. Um, and it's generally fairly easy to defend here. Um, like I said, bringing, bringing turrets is, is, is key and obviously some heavy weapons that you saw there are very useful against bigger enemies. Obviously, I don't know if Boil Titans can spawn here. I, I suppose they can. Um, but we escaped here and <laughs> I decided to keep this in here because it's quite funny. So you can see C3 here, um, people trying to get a cinematic escape is, is always the thing and um, I, I do quite like that. Uh, you can see here he protects uh, Mr. Number 2 and G3 gets his dog on the side. He does some flips and has to jump out last second. I, time's pretty much up, he manages to get onto the ship. So it was quite a good mission, good fun. Um, it's just fresh. I'm, I'm not. I'm more of a fan of like the exterminate missions and the ones that require you to traverse across the map. So, um, especially in this game, but it's nice to get something fresh where you're defending something, um, and some more medals for the new war bond that's releasing in two days is a pretty added, nice added bonus there as well. So I'm really looking forward to that. 
Um, I'm working my way through the other war bonds, but this one looks looks pretty nice. Obviously, with the premium war bonds, number one, you have to pay for them to some degree. Maybe you've collected up super credits, but still. Um, and the metal costs for those usually are a bit higher than the standard war bond, but looking forward to it nonetheless. Um, more fresh content is always good for this game um, and expect to see more of this as we go forward. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you enjoyed the new the new major major order along with the missions and uh, I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.